Are you ready to learn a high win rate scalping strategy that's both simple and profitable? Well, in this video, I will share the simplest and proven profitable scalping strategy that has a fairly high win rate. But before we begin, please click subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss any of my latest videos. Without further ado, let's get straight to the video. Okay, now we are on the XAUUSD chart with a 5 minute time frame. For this strategy, we will use only one type of indicator, the EMA. First, go to the Indicators tab and type MA. The first EMA we will use is the 25 period EMA. Let's make it more visible. Next, insert another EMA, this time using the 50 period EMA. We'll also make this one more visible. Finally, for the last EMA, use the 100 period EMA and make it more visible as well. All right, the system is ready. Before we dive deeper into the strategy, I want to briefly mention the charting platform I'm using, Fastball. It's a powerful tool with some great features that can really enhance your trading experience. Fastball's trading charts are completely free, meaning you don't have to worry about subscription fees. They provide real-time quotes for each symbol, which is essential for staying updated with market movements. One of the features I love is the multi-chart viewing. You can open multiple charts at once, making it easy to compare different markets or timeframes side by side. Fastball even allows you to set up to 64 indicators on a single chart, offering a lot of flexibility for technical analysis. You can also set up multiple alerts based on price movements or indicators to catch trading opportunities in real time. And if you need to backtest, Fastball gives you access to unlimited historical candles, which is a huge advantage over other platforms. Additionally, Fastball offers extensive charting tools that let you draw lines, shapes, and text, helping you to visualize your analysis more clearly. Sharing your charts is also easy, and you can save your favorite setups and templates for quick access later. Finally, Fastball's customizable timeframes allow you to switch between different time scales, from one minute to monthly charts, tailoring the chart display to your specific trading strategy. If you want to check out Fastball, I've included a link in the description below. It's definitely worth trying out, especially if you're looking to take your charting to the next level. Now, with that in mind, let's proceed with the strategy. For the buy signal to be valid, we need to see that the 25 period EMA is above the 50 period EMA and 100 period EMA. Then, we want to see the price is above all of our EMAs. When we have this condition, we want to wait for the price to pull back towards the 25 period EMA or the 50 period EMA and close below it just like this one right here. After that, we want to wait for the price to close back above the 25 period EMA. When all these conditions are met, we will enter our position at the closing of the candle. Then, we will set our stop loss at the 50 period EMA and target 40% of the price. Here is another perfect buy setup. As we can see, the 25 period EMA is above both the 50 period EMA and the 100 period EMA, and the price is also above all of these EMAs. We then can see that the price to pull back towards the EMA and close below 50 period EMA. After the pullback, the price closes back above the 25 period EMA, meeting all our conditions. We will enter our position at the closing of the candle. We'll set our stop loss at the 50 period EMA and target 40% of the price movement. You can also trail your stop loss to capture additional profits. Exactly opposite, for the sell signal to be valid, we need to see that the 25 period EMA is below both the 50 period EMA and the 100 period EMA. Next, we want to ensure that the price is below all of these EMAs. When these conditions are met, we wait for the price to pull back towards the 25 period EMA or the 50 period EMA and close above it. After the pullback, we wait for the price to close back below the 25 period EMA. When all these conditions are met, we will enter our position at the closing of the candle. We'll set our stop loss at the 50 period EMA and target 40% of the price movement. 
Here is another example of a perfect cell setup. As we can see here, the 25 period EMA is below both the 50 period EMA and the 100 period EMA. Additionally, the price is below all of these EMAs. After the price pulls back towards the 25 period EMA or the 50 period EMA and closes above it, we wait for the price to close back below the 25 period EMA. Once all these conditions are met, we will enter our position at the closing of the candle. We will set our stop loss at the 50 period EMA and target 40% of the price movement. You can also trail your stop loss to maximize your profit. Alright guys, let me show you a couple of examples where you should avoid taking an entry to better understand the scalping strategy. As we can see here, the EMAs are close to each other. This indicates that there isn't a clear trend, whether it's an uptrend or a downtrend. So, when you encounter this condition, it's best not to take the entry here. Here is another example of a setup that we should avoid. As we can see, the 25 period EMA is above both the 50 period EMA and the 100 period EMA, and the price is also above all of these EMAs. The price makes a pullback towards the EMAs and then closes back above the 25 period EMA. However, we will not take this entry because the price closed below the 100 period EMA during the pullback. Since not all of our conditions were met, we will skip this trade as well. As you can see, this scalping strategy is highly profitable. It also provides numerous signals for entering the market, which can help you quickly grow your account when trading on a 5-minute time frame. I recommend you give it a try yourself. That wraps up the video. If you found it helpful, be sure to subscribe to my channel for more strategies and tips. Good luck!